The Omicron variant is now in the state of Indiana, and many people have questions about the new variant. Desherry McBroom learned today how the Omicron variant is different from all the others. Desherian. Dana with the Omicron variant. Now in the Hoosier state, health officials want residents to be safe as they finish the holiday season and embark upon the new year. Dr. Brian Dixon, Director of Public Health Informatics at the Regan Shreve Institute, says the Omicron variant spreads faster than the Delta variant. The Omicron variant um, is more transmissible. That means that it spreads to more people um, that, uh, compared to the Delta variant. In fact, it is uh, twice as likely to infect a person as the Delta variant. That's based on the information that we have so far. Dr. Dixon says the booster will be the extra protection the body needs to protect itself against Omicron. He hopes it will help keep residents out of already full hospitals. Things are actually not real good in Indiana right now with COVID-19. Many hospitals are at capacity or near capacity uh, in terms of their existing um, uh, clients, if you will, or patients with COVID-19, as well as patients with other conditions that need hospitalization. So Dr. Rachel Spalding with Good Samaritan says she has seen families hurt by COVID-19, which is why they continue to try to make sure all residents do their best to remain healthy. We know that it rapidly um, you know, can be passed along, um, you know, more so than the previous uh, variants. So that's part of the equation. It's because I think if I look today, I'm going, man, the predominant number of ventilated patients that we have right now wouldn't be in the hospital if they if we didn't have COVID. For those who have or plan to get vaccinated, the question becomes how beneficial is the vaccine against the newest variant? We don't see that many people vaccinated um, being very ill. Um, in the ICU in the hospital. So that's kind of the trend nationwide. You see more unvaccinated that are on ventilators, et cetera. And, but now we're just keeping track of those that were had the vaccine and boosted um, to show the difference. We don't have anyone in the hospital right now that has their vaccine and got their booster. Dr. Dixon says no matter how you protect yourself, whether it's the vaccine or mask, some protection is better than no protection.